Hello everybody, good day to you all. Today I'm talking about Titan season number two, episode number five, Deathstroke. This episode directed by Nick Gomez. In this episode here, you have Dick, you have Donna, you have Don, you have Hank, and you also have Corey, who come who finally finally came back, trying to pretty much um rescue and save Jason. Jason Jason Beast went off and did something stupid. Jason got caught, and so now they're trying to come up with a plan. They're planning to go after them, go after him. And then you have um. They also trying to discuss if they should pretty much give up Rose or not because that's what that's 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 what that's wants. He wants his daughter back, and so he's willing to pretty much kill Jason if he doesn't get what he wants. And so you got the team trying to decide what should they do. And you have Dick a little bit on the fence. He doesn't really want to give up Rose. He doesn't want to do that. But you have um, Hank, who's saying I don't know this chick, and she's Deathstroke's daughter. That's too much trouble. I know, I, even though I don't really like Jason, I hate him. I want to punch him in the face. But I know him. So therefore, we can save him. We got to give, give this girl no more trouble. Let's do that. And she's been discussing all that there. And then, and then you have what's going on with the, with, the, with the teens. You have um, Beast Boy, who's pretty much, um, well, feeling guilty the fact that he been, he, he, um, him and Jason did something this stupid and Jason got caught. So he's feeling bad. He, he, he couldn't do nothing to, to stop it and, or, or save the day. And so he's pretty much snapping at everybody. You have Rachel, who's still trying to, who's struggling to pretty much f f um, c um, control the demon that's inside of her. And it's not her snapping or killing anybody. Yeah. And then you have Rose, who's just who's saying, you know what? Screw all of y'all. Screw you. Okay, you want to get me up? Fine, I'm out. I don't need you. I ain't want to be here in the first place. So peace out. And, she, and you see that she was struggling with, with that. Overall, I, I then, then you have um, was going on the whole relationship going on with um, with uh, Slade and, and Doctor Light, who I don't like on this in the series. But in, at the same time, spoiler right here, he gets killed. So I don't really care because he first of all he didn't act like Doctor Light. He didn't look like Doctor Light, and, and his costume was was terrible. So therefore, when he died, I didn't care as but I don't care. I don't care. I don't care. But I do like I do like the person who's playing Slay Wilson, um, uh, uh, Sam Morales. I think I said his name. And I like his performance on Slay, and the costume looks looks okay. I wish he had had a little more color to it. And I, I, I don't like I don't like the whole red eye thing. I don't like, I don't like that because in the, see using the comma is just blank. It's like, like, like you got the orange side, you got a, a black side. And I wish they did that more. So then like, he don't care if you can't you know you, you know you can't see the eye and you can't see the eye. He doesn't care. Cause he's because he's that good, but having that red eye there kind of makes him look like look like um dead shot. So it, it kind of throws me off a little bit. But overall, with the way the story was told, introduction of Slade in here, how how you how you portrayed by the actor, um the the fight sequences that, that, that they had, was, I thought that was pretty cool. Um, I'm also watching the whole thing situation with, with Rachel struggling with her powers and abilities, trying to learn how to to control them. Should she ran them back, or she try to let them out, or cut loose, and stuff like that too. It, it's nice. Um. Yeah, I really am enjoying that, and watching this, um, watching the the original, the old team at the same time in action is always cool to see. But the, the only problem I really I have with it a lot of times is you, you still have Dick and the, and the team going out in the field fighting the bad guys, not in costume, which I don't like at all. Like I know Dick doesn't have his costume yet, and he still hasn't become a Nightwing just yet. But he should, he should, he should at least wear a mask. Or something like have them put on costumes, have them at least attempt to have a secret identity. But I guess they don't care. I guess they really don't care. I guess they're not. I guess so. I mean, I guess Slade knows them that well, so they're just why bother. But still, it's it, that's the whole point. I don't know. That's the only point that bothers me. That bothers me too much. I mean, yeah. I wish. I, 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 another thing is, like I said before about Doctor Light, I, I wish they, I wish they like, portrayed him a lot better than they do in the combo. The, they do in from the combos because in the, in the combos, Doctor Light was a kind of a goof. He wasn't that. And then you find out that he actually was because the only reason why he acted act, act the way he is because he was brainwashed all the time ago by Justice League, but to be to be this goofball. But he still would. He's but he still looked like a, a a doctor and a scientist. This guy looks like a thug. I don't know. Yeah. So I don't know. But overall, I did enjoy this episode a lot. Um, watching this, uh, watching the whole emotional struggle of the, with the teens over there, find, trying to find their place and trying to not get along, is interesting to me. And even though the, 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 you got Dick and them a, a little grown up, they still had all the baggage that they have from like from from, from the from the last time they were a team, still all mixed in, in there. And then you have Corey, who 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 wasn't there, saying, "Um, they're all acting crazy." Okay. This girl is in trouble. She needs our help. We should be trying to protect her, not just start throwing her through the wolves. Come on, what's wrong with you? What's wrong with you? We could, we could find a way to pretty much do this. And then you have Dick, you have Dick 
who, who, who thinks who's trying to go the, kind of go the, the Batman route by doing everything by himself, which is just stupid. <laughs> but overall, great episode, and they had a, a cool ending. And I'm not sure exactly which way they're going to go. I don't think they're going to end, end the way. I think they're going to end it. But spoiler look right here. Jason might, might be possibly dead, but I don't think that's going to happen. Now, because the thing is, though, the messed up part is, everybody don't have their power to the fullest. Like, Beast Boy is starting to, maybe to turn to other animals, but I'm not, I'm not sure they're going to stick with that just yet. Because so far, I only have turned to a tiger again. And then you have um, Corey, Starfire, who can fly. And then you, you can, now, when I saw Jason go off, off, falling off the... Um, out the window and stuff, I kept thinking to myself, Corey, just, just, just go get him. You can fly. But I don't know if she can fly in this in this world and universe yet, so who knows? We'll see, we'll see where this goes. So, leave your comments down below. Let me know what you thought of this episode of Titans. If you haven't watched it, check it out for yourself. Hopefully when you watch it, you will enjoy having watching it too. So give my channel a big like, hit the thumbs up, shaboop, and subscribe to my channel and share. I would appreciate it, like I always say, in my dreams and my life. I am the Ninja Rabbit. Uh, peace out, uh, peoples.